Coming to you live is the Auto Hub Show, changing automotive one show at a time with Ian and Jeff. And here we go. They're riding the wave like never before. What did you? And they make so much of my order. Major wants to make sure get all we can for it. Broadcast, broadcast here. And like five years later, sure, that's pretty, that's pretty good. But he's also saying he's doing what he's doing. Exactly. He is working with his sales staff. He's an award-winning dealer year after year after year. He's worked with his sales staff so that they understand that if things change, that they they can't do what they're doing now. Give everybody the experience today right. that they're going to give me. Exactly. Yeah, you can't just show them the order pad. Right, exactly. Which Take they probably stop right. think sometimes. In fact, even sometimes, did you hear about the uh, the Chevy dealer somewhere down in the south? He's charging, making people sign a order form in the Zettel Six Corvette, a new one. And it was 90, right on the 90,000 over MSRP. They had to put $6,000 non refundable no matter what you got. Well, it's all the it's a big lady named Mary, Mary, not Barry, Mary, and uh, all of a sudden they, they apologize. Oh yeah, I mean, why, we, why do people hate car again? Um, yeah, we're not really sure. Uh, okay. We were too nice. <laughs> right. no, we no, and I and, and see that is what causes these high category negatives. Where if you don't know anything else, you go probably can't trust a party. When there's thousands of car dealers that are playing it straight, that are delivering great value and a great experience, it's these few exceptions that make the news, and therein lies the rub. Yeah, uh, Jackson have, Five have, have something that? like that. One bad apple. Don't we, but don't we have that like every year on the local news station with oh, a yeah. used car dealer and go, oh yeah, let's let's get this guy on secret camera to talk about uh, how they do things here. Yeah, exactly. no, we, we get picked on. And by the way, Jeff. We don't need any of your Jackson 5 out oh, today. <laughs> <laughs> I think that the sad thing to me is that dealers often mistake customer experience with lack of knowledge. It doesn't have to be. It's ask good. Apple. Ask Apple. Exactly. Yeah, that's there was exactly. a reason. I don't have an Apple phone anymore just because I wanted to change. But the best thing about Apple is you go in and somebody wears a nice little t shirt says, all these words you can't understand. Right? I will just have to get change the algorithm. You have to do this in there. It's fixed. It's great. And by the way, there's no challenge. We have to make part of the argument to the experience that we have. When you go into this Lucid, I went in this Lucid. Now, this, if you haven't seen this car, yeah, it's, it's unbelievably cool. Yeah, yeah. But this fresh faced young guy, I can't buy one. I mean, they're, they're 12 sure. years ago. He went through this car, and I told him, I'm not buying it. Let me tell you. And he knew everything there was. And that's it was fun. Oh, but the car the car's to die for. Oh, Bentley's a Bentley and out Lamborghini's a Lamborghini. But we won't talk about Lucid. Yeah, um, I mean it was interesting with Lucid because I went on a test driving one and, and initially when they opened the store, all they had was a pre production prototype, which by the way when car driver ten bass without having a problem. Not to say that that's harsh on car driver by any stretch. But I went on this test drive with a friend of mine and every model of that car, the front seats don't match the back seats in color. So I was like, okay, so did you run out of gray fabric? Did you run out of He's like, oh no, that's the design element of our oh, experience car. It was, it was very interesting. Yeah, every, yeah, every I'm, I'm surprised that you don't just, understand yeah, this different yeah. colors in the back seat. Yeah, just well, you know, didn't it's happening all. everywhere yeah, now. Sure I, have, I have no idea. Well, oh, by the way, they also have sustainable leather. Which sustainable I'm not really leather. sure what that means. Is, is, that, is that real leather? It's real leather because, you know, the But like they, you can put it back on a cow when you're done or. Uh, well, I don't know if the cat wants it, but you know, if you think about it, all the the big thing of all the electric cars is this is this vegan leather. Yeah, so I don't know. I don't know what that is. Uh, well, I think we're I never forget bird. Mercedes MD Tex. Yeah, well, it's going fine. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So yeah. I apologize for that. But um, the, like I said, the car you get in that car, the aroma's amazing. The comfort's amazing. 
but the experience is amazing. No, I think it's those massage seats. That's cool. yeah. I think that probably yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. 12 yeah. massage seats for yeah. the driver yeah. and right. dresser until they crash with our right. And you see, this is why we didn't do an ambush interview because we know we don't be talking. Yeah, I understand. Right. Um, by the way, this is Alan and Ray from Fuse because I know I didn't do the intro to my job. I thank both of you so much. We thank both of you so much. Thank you. What a lot of fun talking. It's great. Good to see you guys again, too. Thanks very much. Always keep up the good work. Always. All right. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks for joining us. It was a great show. And follow us anywhere you would like on your favorite podcast, on Facebook, on LinkedIn, and, of course, on our YouTube, or subscribe to our own channel.